then in the diagram on the right, AOB is a semicircle. So AOB is a semicircle. So we see here AOB. So this is AOB is a semicircle. Alright. With center D. And AEB is an arc. So AEB is an arc of a circle with center C. So we have two center here. So AOB with center D and AEB with center C. Center C, so it given the, this one. The equation AB is this one, is equal to 1. So now calculate the area of triangle ABC. So area ABC, so this triangle. So here we know the equation that X, is, X over 6 plus Y over 8 is equal to 1. So we know this is X intercept and this is Y intercept. So we know that B is, X intercept is 6, 0. And y intercept is 0, 8. So now we have 3 points, this one, this one, and this one. So when we have 3 points, we can find area using coordinate. Area is equal to half. So if we start from C, we need to end with C. And if we start from here, we can we need to end with here. So I think the one with 0 will be easier to start with. So I think 0, 8. So 0, 8, and then 7, 7. A, C, B, A. So, A, C, B, I need to come back to A. So, B is 6, 0 and then this one is 0, 8. So, here, so this one will be multiply 0 times 7, 0, 7 times 0, 0, 6 times 8 is 48. So, B dot above is minus, minus, 8 times 7 is 56, 7 times 6 is minus 42, 0 times 0 is 0 lah. So here we get half negative 50. So it's equal to half 50. So here I get 25 unit. So the area of ABC is 25 unit square. So B, angle ACB in DT. So here if I take out the triangle here. So I have A here, C here, B here. So the coordinate here, this one is 0, 8. So C is equal to 7, 7. And then this one is equal to 6, 0. So if I know what is this one, this one, and this one. So if I know what is the distance. So if I know the distance, then I can use solution of triangle. I can use cosine rule. So cosine rule, what does it mean? So cos theta is equal to a square plus b square minus c square over 2ab. So here, if this angle is here, so I will have to minus this one. So all I need is just the uh, distance between the point. So to calculate the distance between points, so the distance between points is that you have to calculate. So square root so distance of x square plus distance of y square so this is a formula so here to find ac ac is equal to so just open the third so x is 7 minus 0 7 minus 0 square or you can see that 0 minus 7 is also a uh, same because like you need to square so here would be plus so distance is y is 7 minus 8 7 minus 8 so which is equal to 7 square plus negative 1 square so here I get square root 50 so here so 50 so the distance of CB is equal to so the distance of X CB so 6 and 7 so 6 minus 7 square plus distance in Y is 0 minus 7 so 0 minus 7 so in this case, I get negative 1 square plus negative 7 square. And you can see that 1 plus 49 is set 50. So this one, we also get set 50. And then for AB, so AB is equal to set. So the distance between the X is 0 and 6. So 6 minus 0 square plus distance in Y is 0 and 8. So 0 minus 8. So here I get... 6 square plus negative 8 square, so basically 100 or 
10. So, I know that the distance here is 10. So, here cos theta is equal to a square. So, this is the angle that we wanted to find. So, this one is a. a and b is uh, the line in between the angle. So, b set 50 square plus set 50 square minus c is 10. 10 square divided by 2 set 50 times set 50. You see here, this one is 2ab. So, here you will get 0. So, cos theta is equal to 0. So, theta is equal to cos inverse 0 which is equal to 90 degree. So, ACB in degree is 90 degree. So, here we know that AC is set 50. So, this one is set 50 and this one is 10. See the area of the shaded region. So, we see here the area of shaded region is here. So, how to calculate the area of shaded region? So, we see here to calculate the area of shaded region, first you can find the, so we see here the larger one is that we can take the area of sector. So, the sector of the semicircle here is AOB, AOB, and then we have to minus the segment here. You see here the segment, area of segment AE. A, D, B, E. So, here A, D, B, E. Then we can get the shaded region. So, we see here the larger one here minus this segment here and you will get the shaded region in unit square. Lah. So, first area, area of sector A, O, B is equal to so sector half R square theta. So, we need to know the radius and we need to know the theta. So, here is 10 now. Alright. So, half so, we know that this one is a semicircle. So, semicircle 180 degree. So, we know that 360 degree is equal to 2 pi. So, 180 degree is pi radian. So, R here, the radius here is from A, half AB. So, we know that AB is 10 cm, 10 unit, I'm sorry. So, this one is 5 and this one is 5. So, half 5 square and theta is pi, pi or 3.142. So, here we get... 39.275 unit square. Now we have area of sector. So just right here 39.275. And then area of segment. So here area of segment is equal to. So to find area of just this segment is equal to area of. So you see here the sector one. Area of this sector. Of area of sector AEB. AEB minus area of triangle, area of triangle ACB. So ACB, okay, this is the first one. This is how to find the shaded one and this one is to find the segment. So, here area of the sector is equal to, area of sector is equal to half R square theta. Half, so the radius of this one, so the radius is AC. You see here this one is 50 square and theta here so we know that acb in degree is 90 degree so again here so 90 degree here 360 to 90 degree we divide by 4 so this one divide by 4 we get pi over 2 so radian would be pi over 2 or 3.142 divided by 2 so here we get 39.275 unit square so here we get 39.275 So area of triangle So when we have a triangle We can use SOT Solution of triangle So we have 90 degree here So this one is 50 This one is also 50 So area of triangle is equal to half So 50 times 50 Or just write 50 square And then sign Theta. theta is 90 degrees. So here we get 25 unit. So here we get 25 unit. So here area of segment A, D, B, E. So this one, the small one, the area of the small one is equal to area sector this one. Which is 39.275 minus area of the triangle which is 
25 unit square. So here we get 14.275 unit square. So this one we get 14.275. So now the area. So now area of shadow is equal to area of sector is 39.275 minus area of this segment which is 14.275. Now we get 25 unit square.